going on Libra welcome to told as love tarot um, I hope you like and subscribe this is for Libra placements Sun Moon Rising Venus or if you have a bunch of Libra in your chart make yourself comfortable as I am right now on camera um, Libra I have a message for you or I'm connected with a Libra who um, you're very good at something you have a very good skill or it might even be your job or it might be a talent or a skill that you're just so good at it you could close your eyes and still do it and um, I have this feeling like there's a Libra who wishes they could talk more about all the things that they know or could share their knowledge um, because they feel like they maybe know a lot about this subject matter or about this talent or skill that you have and you're, um, you're thinking about or wishing you could like share it more or talk about it more with, um, people. Also something about having to wait. You might be waiting to hear from someone, ha being told to wait, trying to wait. Maybe it's a self-control thing, Libra. Oh. Take it as it resonates. If it doesn't resonate, go check out your other um, signs in your chart. If you're here to check out what's going on with the Libra cross watcher, come on in. Just make sure you subscribe and tell a friend. <clears throat> um, I hope you're doing, you're happy, healthy, and well. You are the first of my air signs, Libra. We are just at, we just exited Aquarius season. A, there we go. A um, what you call it? <coughs> air sign, and now we're in Pisces season. I'm rolling my eyes because I feel like I've said this in several readings now, but I am shuffling the S H I T out of these cards. And some of the same cards are coming out, which in the, the grand scheme of things actually does make sense because we all have um, different um, signs in our charts. So it would make sense that if I see these cards here, like it would make sense that I had just seen them there. But oh, um, I guess I should say what I'm saying, huh? Um, Ace of Pentacles and the Chariot. That's Earth energy and then that's Cancer energy. But actually, I just learned also in a reading that um, the figure that's on the Chariot in the Chariot card is supposed to be, or I mean is, as I learned today, the Emperor. So as soon as I heard that, I was like, uh-huh, well, I can associate... Cancer energy, the chariot card with maybe Aries energy and maybe dominant and being, um, taking charge to move forward. Um, Libra, five of, um, cups at the bottom of the deck, followed by the ace of cups in reverse, followed by the three of cups upright. That's a whole lot of cups, a whole lot of emotion. I guess he couldn't really see those, but. I feel like someone is worried that they're, I'm here and like not gonna make a good impression. Like, should I get flowers? Should I bring, like I'm, someone is like super nervous right now. Something may be moving forward faster than you expected, Libra especially with that chariot card here. Um, I feel like you're charging after something you want or something you want is charging after you, Libra. Hey. Let's get one more. 
for the Libra. Also, I had a message earlier about someone wanting to be fancy or having a desire to, to dress up and do something fancy. Maybe you haven't dressed up in a while, Libra. One more for Libra. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. 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 I said one more and what comes out? <laughs> Everything. All right. So we got five of um, pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Page of swords reverse. Knight of cups. Right off the bat, that makes me think someone not communicating about how they're feeling or are spying and watching someone because they are actually have a lot of feelings. But to me, it's a, something about someone not knowing how much someone likes them. Maybe this <clears throat> ties in with the nerves. Three of Wands. which is a card of like waiting or <clears throat> looking forward. Ooh, and then we have the King of Pentacles. It's not a true pair, but it has shows a couple on it. it kind of looks like a couple. <sighs> Libra. So maybe because this is the at the beginning, this is something Libra you have wanted for a while. See how she's like hiding behind that coin. I feel like this is some sort of temptation. I don't feel like it's a person. I feel I mean, it could be a person like someone you really, really want or whatever. But I feel like this is an opportunity, a job, an increase in pay, something that you've been wanting and working towards or chasing after could be again if it is a person you could be getting to know them trying to spend time with them trying to put in an effort because you're trying to all build towards um maybe giving an offer i just think i see a woman holding the coin and now i see the man holding the coin This is going to sound really tacky as hell, <clears throat> Libra, but it just popped into my head. Something about like someone, like a woman giving it up. Like maybe uh, there was a masculine chasing a woman, chasing a woman, chasing a woman. Chasing a female specifically. <clears throat> and then once someone got what they wanted, it was over. Once someone, however this resonates, Libra, someone was only out after one thing, and that was to be able to conquer you, be with you, have sex with you, beat you, however that, not physically, but like a win, however that resonates, and I feel like they charged after it. They may have communicated that there were feelings and that they really wanted to be with you, but I think that that may have been a lie um like straight up childish bullshit lying to someone just so they can get in their pants essentially and as soon as libra this person got in your pants or however this resonates you like dipped or they dipped and like you just stopped hearing from them that's for somebody out there I'm seeing someone right here being like left out in the cold and wondering like, what did I do wrong? But it's in reverse. Maybe it wasn't communicated wondering like, what did I do wrong? However, this resonates Libra. It's a sad thing to resonate if it does. This really isn't kind of a cool reading the magician reversed magician reversed is the energy of 
Um, I've heard it be called a used car salesman. So it's someone who is going to tell you what they know you want to hear. And you, Libra, may have want may have wanted to hear something emotional, something about like we're on the same page here. I want to move forward with this. I have a thing for you too. And someone I feel like communicated that or was going along with it. And they knew damn well someone here had feelings or there was an interest here. And I feel like someone just said whatever they needed to say to get someone in bed. Um, I feel like there was never any intention of something long term here. It was just wanting to get after what they wanted and then they got it and it's like they're all set now. Now, this may not be sexual. I don't know what else it could be, but it is coming across as very sexual in nature to me. Um, someone may have been obsessively thinking about, like, what um, intimacy would be like, and it was just almost like they were blinded by that desire to be with this person and I'm feeling like it's not even just uh an attraction thing because the wands are here and the the devil here tells me like there was attraction like sexiness and like attraction but the fact that it's an ace of pentacles here it, and the magician reversed it makes me think someone led someone else to believe like that it was emotional and would be something of substance maybe they showed all the qualities of this like i'm on the same page i want to build with you i'm looking for a connection and i'm looking for someone who wants to date and start going out with me and like I feel like that could have been waved in your face, Libra, or however this resonates. This person with these beautiful mesmerizing eyes who like just sucked you right in, Libra, or again, however it resonates. They may have led you to believe that it would be something of substance. And that's why things either went so fast or someone charged in so quickly because there was a belief here that this was something real, that this was something tangible, that this wasn't just someone trying to like wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, and or just get their ends and bounce, not use someone. <clears throat> there was trust here. And I feel like someone was lying, which is really effed up. Someone was just straight lying because they wanted to have you Libra or you about them it's like a possessed a possessiveness thing of wanting to have you wanting to dominate wanting to possess wanting it's the chase maybe that's what this is someone wanting the chase and loving the chase yeah I mean the chariot card is here and that's literally traveling and I feel like Libra, someone here got caught up in a chase and someone, all I can see is like her hands pointing up and down, but this is like someone saying, you here in my bed. They wanted, they wanted to get into someone's pants very badly. This is a rated R reading, but this is where this is taking me to. And I feel like as soon as they got it, Libra, as soon as they freaking got it, you weren't even backing out of the driveway yet, heading home. And they were already looking on to the next, looking at what, well, oh, my lights. Looking on to the next as those lights went off. Ta-da! This person was already or looking on to the next or considering the next. Maybe this person is addicted to this. Maybe it's like an addictive cycle for this person. Come in, lure them in. Gets what they want. Peace. I'm out. <clears throat> Peace. I'm out. I can't hear you. Uh, oh, I was asleep. Sorry.
because they're holding the coin. They're holding what they were after in the beginning, what you had or what they were trying to offer to you. Like, oh, come here, come here, little girl. <laughs> and they got what they wanted from you, Libra, or you from them. There's multiple pentacles on this house because this person is addicted to doing this and has done this to more than one person, Libra. So if this is you, Libra, this is not cool. And I can't say the things that I want to be saying in my head because this is not cool. If this is being done to you, Libra, there's nothing you could have done to do this, to do anything differently. Because it it's sad to say, but like it wasn't about you in the personal, emotional, who you are as a person sense, Libra. It was this person's desire and addiction to like overtake, dominate, to have, to add a little notch on their bedpost, a little notch on their wherever. Like this is, I almost want to say this person like with an agenda and they may have like some ser like, I mean, if you have to be doing shit like this, you're, you have some serious to me, mental issues, because this totally fucks with, excuse me, this totally messes with people, and like really messes with people, messes with people's intuitions too, because if you're told to believe someone and trust someone, and at the end of it, you just end things and close your eyes after you've gotten what you wanted, that can really affect someone, someone who put their trust in another. Libra, if this has been done to you, please know, I feel like this person does this and it's like their MO, it's like they have a house of cards, a house of lies, I'm hearing, like they've built their life up on like shit like this, seeing someone or something that they want, doing whatever the hell they have to say, whatever manipulative, emotional, or, um verbal thing that they have to say they're gonna say it so they can get what they want and once they get what they want they just are done they're done with you and i i feel like you did not know this you had no idea this was obviously i mean if you knew this was happening or gonna happen and you jumped in i'd say libra we need to talk about some like self-esteem and self-worth here but i don't think you knew that this is gonna ha that was gonna happen to you because it it was like this is the this is this person doing a walk of shame this is that person doing a walk of shame she doesn't know what she did wrong but all of a sudden it was it was over and a taxi or an uber was being called for her and being paid for by this person because they'd gotten what they'd wanted and they were already moving on one more time, I just feel the need to say, Libra, if this resonates with you and this was done to you, this was not anything you did wrong or unfortunately, this person sees people and ob like people as objects and it's about want and the chase and when they want something, it's like someone, I don't want to compare people to like things but if someone really wanted like a bow or a wave run or whatever and they were damn determined to continue to work really hard for it and even the having it at the end of having to work so hard for it it tastes that much sweeter once you've gotten it because you worked this hard for it <clears throat> I feel like this is someone who does this they, they attract people or they offer things. They may have done this to previous relationships. This could have been, you could be doing this, Libra. And I, again, if you are, this is not cool. But if it was done to you, Libra, it's this is that person's pattern. And you did not know it going into this. And they manipulated you and you were told to trust them. And you did. And... It wasn't you, it's this person. 
some emotional and um, mental health issues here that this person um, hides well, I think, obviously, because I feel like there was a Libra that, or Libra policeman, like, right after this shit happened or whatever happened, it was like, oh my gosh, I'm seeing you in a totally different light. You're not the cool person that can make things happen and has all this great stuff because you worked for it. You're a manipulative SOB who has screwed people over to get ahead and get everything that you have. It's not you, it's them, Libra. This message is for somebody out there and I'm definitely feeling like someone out there is like, yeah, Megan, <laughs> yeah, girl, I needed this. Last card for Libra. It's gonna be all right. Keep your head held high. I keep hearing keep your head held high. You look great. You look fabulous, Libra. Her earrings have a V. The person you're dealing with could have a V. Their name, first or last name, but it's V for victory. Someone's walking away with from something with dignity. With dignity and like the victor here i don't know how you can be victorious in this situation but it's like <sighs> i won maybe there were some last things said at the end but like someone you libra or however this resonates i feel the person who kind of got screwed over here and manipulated is walking away or has walked away with their head held high um I feel like it's being noticed or it was noticed that you took something that was really shitty. You took it to the chin and you held your head high and you're coming out of this a, um, a victor. I keep thinking like victorious, the one with the upper hand, like <clears throat> you made a power play and now you have the power Libra. Please let me know if it resonates and um, don't let anybody get you in your head. Don't let anyone make you defensive and in your head and make you question yourself just because they were a sneaky SOB with some mental health issues. You're stronger than that, Libra. All right, I'll see you next time. Adios, bye.